The first model of our course is called Why is Cybersecurity Important? People are talking about cybersecurity here and there, and companies invest millions of dollars in them trying to prevent data breaches and keep their data safe. When hearing such news, it comes to mind that it happens somewhere far away from here, and you will never be part of it. I wish it was true, but unfortunately, whenever we are at home, work, or sitting in the nearest cafe, dreamingly looking out the window and sipping coffee, we become vulnerable to cyber attacks. Agenda for today. Why cybersecurity is important. Cybersecurity threats. Massive cybersecurity news happened in 2023. Practical exercise. I will give you a practical exercise that we can discuss on our live training call. And quiz, of course. How can I forget about the quiz? We will be discussing correct answers during our live training call as well. The first reason why cybersecurity is important is that cybercrime has increased in recent years. During the pandemic, a tremendous amount of businesses all around the world moved to remote work environments. Cybercriminals took advantage of misaligned networks. In 2020, malware attacks increased 358% compared to 2019. It's essential for businesses to learn how to protect themselves from cyber attacks. For example, a checkpoint report, also known as InfoSecurity magazine, found that in the first quarter of 2023, the global incidence of cyber attacks increased by 7% compared to the same time a year before. And here it comes the next reason. Cybersecurity builds trust. By implementing authentication and access control, being transparent with data handling and privacy policies, a company will earn trust naturally. Cybersecurity protects user identities. We are talking about logging and passwords for different accounts and devices. If we ask an average person about his password, I'm sure that 90% of the time that person would say that he has been using the only one password for all his accounts and devices. Well, perfect and easy scenario for one more cyber crime. Do you remember the saying, an ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure? Basically, it's cheaper, easier and better to invest time and money into preventing cyber attacks in the first place rather than trying to clean up and recover from it afterwards. Vulnerability management by cybersecurity protocols. It's essential to follow cybersecurity protocols. Less chances to get compromised. Since we know why cybersecurity is important, we need to understand what to be concerned about. It is time to stare the enemy in the face. The list of cybersecurity threats is long. We will be talking about the most common ones. So, the first one is personally identifiable information. Your company certainly holds and needs to safeguard the information you store on clients, users, and your own internal staff. Cyber attacks put this information at risk, which can expose people to identity theft, scams, and further attacks. You and your company do not want to be responsible for such information being breached. Reputational damage is a threat to the good name or standing of a business. Beyond financial and operational, your company's reputation can be damaged long-term by either failing to prevent attacks, but also how it responds to inevitable attack. Operational attacks Attacks such as ransomware can freeze key operations or nearly all operations across the board of a company, effectively shutting them down. Shutdowns not only affected organizations, but also their customers. 
This is especially dramatic when key infrastructure such as water, energy, medical, and other important services are affected. Financial attacks. In addition to the cost incurred by a freeze in operations, any attack incurs significant cost to respond to and repair damage from the attack. Such financial repercussions can devastate companies. Third-party companies. It is highly likely your company is plugged into, has access to, and may even provide IT services and data connected into third-party organizations. If your cyber defenses are breached, Attackers can use your access and connections to further infiltrate organizations and users downstream from you. Let's briefly have a look at the massive cyber news of 2023. In January, Twitter was in the middle of yet another PR disaster after a criminal hacker leaked more than 220 million users' email addresses. September was the biggest data breach of the year by far, when the digital risk protection company Darkbane exposed an astounding 3.8 billion records. And in August 2023, the Electoral Commission of the UK issued a public notification of what it called as complex cyber attack, in which hostile actors gained access to the UK electoral registers, which contained an estimate 40 million people's personal information. I bet you are a little shocked and keep asking yourself, how did it happen and why? To all these questions we will answer during our live call. We will discuss each of the news in more detail and understand why and how it happened. Time flies. And now it's time for a practical exercise. In every model, I will have a practical exercise for you to complete. We will be discussing it during our live training call. From the following list, which is presented in the next slide. Please select and access one annual review of the cybersecurity landscape from the previous year. From the annual report, you choose one observation and select key finding or prescription that you think is especially relevant and helpful for your own organization's security. In our next live training call, we will be discussing this information and the reasons for why you think it's important for your company. Here you go, it's a quiz time. In every model, we have a quiz for you to complete. Please complete this quiz and during our live training call, we will be doing work on mistakes.